Hello, my name is John Gentazio. I just want to shoot this video real quick with some uh, tips and tricks to help you guys with your online presence. So without further ado, I'll get right into it. So I did search for you guys and I can't really find you anywhere. So what I'm kind of going to do is show you what your competitors are doing. And I can kind of copy them and uh, siphon off some of their traffic. So I'm not sure if you know these guys, Tint Pros and Mar Tip Pros Meraki. Uh, the... They don't really have much of a nice looking website either. Um, the competition in your area is actually very easy. But there's these guys too. There's two things, three things that matter in getting your presence on Google at the, to the top of Google. And that's through content, citations, and backlinks. So I'll explain those as I, as I go along. But content is anything on a website or related pictures and what they're saved as. So all this would be content. And Google likes to see anywhere from 1,500 to 2,000 words, depending on your competition. And the reason for this is so that you can fit in buyer intent keywords, such as window tinty Milwaukee and window tint installers, and not look spammy and to provide value for the user searching. So like these, these are all like kind of window, these are somewhat keywords. I always like to stick a location next to them because they're easier to rank for. But I'll show you these keywords in a minute and how much search volume they get. But Google likes to provide value for the user. So the more content you have on a website, the more likely Google is to show you to someone searching for a service in your area. So Wikipedia, if you've ever noticed that pretty much any time you search anything non-service related, Wikipedia almost always shows up. And the reason for this is because they have so much content, thousands and thousands of words of content on their pages. And it's providing the most value for the user searching. So that's why they always show up. And the second reason they always show up is backlinks. Backlinks is a mention of your, of your website inside of uh, another website, blog posts, or anything. So not all backlinks are created equal. You can't put yourself inside of a site Pizza Hut because it's not going to be relevant to your niche. Google actually goes through, it reads content on a website, and it's reading and says, oh, this guy's talking about window tinting, and it's on Pizza Hut, and it's talking about making pizzas. It can even mark you as spam sometimes because it's not relevant. While if you can go put yourself inside of these guys or something like that, it's going to help you out a lot because it's niche related. And... All those blue highlighted words on Wikipedia, those are backlinks pointing from one page to another page and other websites and back and forth. And it's telling Google, hey, this is trusted. So it's pretty much just connecting a path of power from website to website. And that's how Wikipedia always shows up. And that's not even like part of their plan. It's just they have so much. That's why they do. But these guys, they have lots of content on their website, like pictures. They just, it's a, it's a good looking website. It's easy to navigate. Everything's good about it. That's why they're showing up. And the last one is citations. So citations is a mention of your name, address, and phone number throughout directories. That's going to get you in this map pack right here. And that's where 80% of people search. So when someone's searching for a window tinting service, they almost always go to this map pack here because... I mean, who the heck comes down here? Nobody. But they're going to go right here, and they're usually going to go with the guy who has the most reviews and been in business the longest, has the nicest looking website, and so on. So there's no reason why they wouldn't. And if you go into these guys, they have all their services laid out, their location. They have lots of pictures in here. So you would have more pictures in your competitor. So if they have 50 pictures, add 100. So they just go on and on and on. Google likes to see the most, uh, let's say, activity on a page. So if you go on these pages, there's questions and answers. You go through and you, you can ask all the questions. See, this has one question. How much blah, blah, blah. That's a stupid question. But you could ask your question right here yourself, like what people normally ask. And then you can also answer it yourself. So that way when someone searches something, you're going to show up. <clears throat> and then responding to reviews is really big. So between 
getting reviews, responding to reviews, adding pictures. Uh, what was the other one? Answering your questions, updating everything. That's going to make you get on top of Google with all those citations. So, yeah, these guys, I have this tool called HRS. It kind of tells you what's going on in the background of a website. So, these guys right here, they're currently bringing in, wait for it to load. Things frozen. These guys are bringing in 385 people a month. They're ranking for a thousand keywords. They have a lot of backlinks. So these guys are doing pretty good. Um, definitely easy to beat though. They've had their website going for about seven years. But these guys, I think ever loads. I'm pretty sure they're bringing in about a thousand people a month. Um, no, 700. See, so they. These guys, they're not even doing that much, but they're just, they're ranking because the competition isn't very high over there. So if I go into here, you can kind of see, so Window Tinty Milwaukee gets a thousand searches a month. This KD means between zero and a hundred, the amount of people ranking for it. So an eight, it's not too difficult, but uh, there's a lot of, look at this, what Tint Shop Milwaukee, Window Tinting Pros Milwaukee, all thousand searches, 700 searches, 90 searches. You could rank for all these keywords and bring in all the traffic these guys are bringing in. And I don't know about you, but 700 people a month looking at your website is going to bring in a lot more clients than Facebook is. So, uh, yeah, this is content, citations, and backlinks. It's going to get you on the top of Google. Uh, if you have any questions, you could reach out to me and I can help you out. You can take these tips and tricks and do them yourself if you like. They're definitely doable by yourself. Uh, but I can help you out if you like. Uh, just let me know what you think about this video. God bless.